Hey, I'm Carthen Audio, and if you want to hear spicier content, find me on Patreon by googling my name. Thanks. Enjoy the audio. And here we are. And wouldn't you know it, we are a bit, ahem, way too early. <laughs> Sorry, I thought there would be more traffic than that. Well, they do say it's better to arrive a bit early for an interview, though. Show you're punctual, you know? So, how do you feel? Let me have a look at you. Wow. Babe, you look amazing. Well, you always do. <laughs> but really, this suit looks awesome on you. That, and your makeup, plus the way you did your hair. I bet you whatever you want, their jaws will drop on the floor when they see you. No, I'm not exaggerating. You know what? You look so good. It's almost a shame only me and the interviewers get to see you like this. So, how about when you're done here... We go to that fancy new restaurant that opened down the road. Yeah, that one. You told me you wanted to try it. Why not seize the occasion, right? I expected a more enthusiastic response. <laughs> Is everything all right? You've been really quiet since this morning. And you do look a bit pale. Do you feel sick, or...? Ah... Uh, yeah, I guess it's normal to feel a bit stressed out before a job interview. Well, I get that, but... If they contacted you and went through all the trouble to set this interview up, I mean... It means they think you are the right fit for the job, don't you think? You just need to prove to them how talented you are, and I know you are. <laughs> yeah, I understand. Now that you're about to start something new, it's normal to recall the bad experiences you had. I remember you coming home with a sad face and eyes full of tears way too often. It broke my heart each time, love. Look, I get that you're afraid everything will go wrong again. But, while it's true some of your previous experiences weren't good ones, it doesn't mean it's bound to be a disaster again this time. Even if sometimes it felt like a complete failure, you had some days of success. And not enough, maybe, but they still exist. The fact that you experienced failure doesn't mean you are one. Far from it. Believe me. You might be a bit afraid from those past experiences, but that doesn't mean you don't still get out there and try again. Uh, you know, actually... <clears throat> I see in your eyes the same fear that would take the heart of me. A day may come when the courage of men fails. When we forsake our friends and break all bonds of fellowship. But it is not this day. An hour of wolves and shattered shields. When the age of men comes crashing down, but it is not this day. This day we fight. <laughs> right? <laughs> Come on, I mean, it did get a little laugh out of you. <laughs> I know, I'm not Aragorn, and you're not an army ready for battle. Still, I stand by what I said. You know, things might be scary, but that doesn't mean you just give up. Hey, tell you what. Can you list three of your most recent successes for me? Okay, that's one. Da 
That's two. And one last one. <laughs> yes. That counts too. Perfect. Keep them in the back of your mind. Once inside, if you feel paralyzed by the stress, try to remember them. Remember your qualities, your bravery, your eagerness, and your dependability. That and the countless other talents you have, they define you. Not your insecurities and never your failures. Well, if it doesn't work out, if they decide not to hire you for whatever reason, it will still be okay. If not for this particular company, you'll still be a great asset for another. After all, it doesn't need to be this particular place. Many businesses around here need someone motivated and skilled like you. What you need, my wonderful baby, is a place that will make you happy and where you can blossom. And you will find it, I promise you. Oop, yes, you're right. It's time to go. <laughs> Don't worry, love. You still look wonderful. Not a hair out of place. Oh, wait. If I can just have your hand there. What? I wouldn't want to smudge your lipstick by kissing your lips. Anyway, I'll be here, telepathically sending you good vibes. And uh, I'll call the restaurant, too. <laughs> good luck, love. Don't worry, huh? You've got this. <laughs>